Welcome back, attractive and well-educated watchers, to a brand new episode of NeanderCon, the most exceptional here on C2C, that's Caveman to Cosmos, the best version of Civ ever made. Last time we left off, we took over uh, Jerusalem, and we were trying to keep it by sending patrols over. A cool thing is that every patrol is technically a defendy guy. Also, we lost some stuff. Uh, unfortunate like, uh, we just, uh, we lost a couple of turns. It, it wasn't a big thing. Um, we just lost a couple of turns. It, it's fine. Uh. So every patrol guy that we send over here. No, things are dangerous. Things are, things are bad, actually. In, uh, this particular area. But... But we have a lot of people that they have to go through. A lot. So we're not super worried. Patrols will be pouring into Hazel Wolf every day. Uh, and then we'll be making them guys that lower revolt risk and uh, other stuff. Wait a second. There was a... Uh, Culture Clock Punk! Yeah! Yeah, okay, no, we remember, right, so, because we want Clockpunk so bad, we are just going to spend for the supply trains. Uh, right, and we are going through the entire territory and tearing down all French infrastructure and starting from the beginning all over again. That's what we're doing. That's our story and we're sticking to it. Guy right here, he'll tear you to bits. Well, I mean, he's pretty strong, because he's not like... You know what we're talking about. Anyway, if you're excited to see what happens today, remember to like, subscribe, and do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our Linktree link, find all of the various different places that we make stuff. Head on down to our Patreon, if you're an especially attractive and well-educated watcher, and pledge even just $1 a month to uh, help support the cause and uh, join the many, many ranks of Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time, and Tollpanzer, our number one watcher of all time. And, of course, get your name in the game, because every one of these cities is named after a patron, except for Constantinople, that's named after us. Uh, you know, because that, that's reasonable, we like to think. Okay, somebody just killed an assassin, we can tell. Yeah, but a bunch of other dumb people are doing dumb stuff. Uh, bloop. Bloop. Kill that arsonist. Kill... That guy. Gosh, move him right up there. Uh, you go here. Not what we meant to do. We need to fix that right now. Throwing off our groove. Now you're surrounded, bucko. Alright. Hmm, you know what? Yeah, not, not allowed. We don't... Uh, okay, guess. Sure. But we are gonna start hunting things down with that. Uh, we want you to go here. Uh, oh, you already have one of those. Well, we want you to go all the way then. Because we are just gonna start delivering patrols in mass. Okay. And then we're gonna... Okay, so we wanna... We wanna check something real quick. Cargo size 100. So we guess... These guys only have cargo size 66. So that's why we can't... Mm, we don't like that, but we guess we can accept it. Like... We guess... Uh, but we don't have to like it. I'm just gonna put that out there. Alright, speed up that clock punk. Just do it. Just crush it. Next supply train. Go. We need to have clock punk. That needs to be 
our technology and our technology alone. Nobody else can have ornithopters, baby! Ooh, flying machines! Hundreds of years early. Caesar of Carthage right now is the most technologically advanced guy in the field. Uh, no, the Zulu are a fellow, they're the, no! Don't be silly. Don't do attacks on fellow Buddhists. That's definitely not what we stand for. Oh, yeah, get out of our town. Drop him. Drop him. Bring it back. Do we have a... Uh, we don't. That's okay. Oh, boy -oh. Let's get that church school going. And defense. Merc him. Take care of him, man. In defense of the city, it just gives us more stuff, more, uh... No, you just hold up. Yeah, when you do that, it also just gives us more, uh, culture. So eventually the culture will reach Tavern Town, and then they will be connected, and Tavern Town will be pacified. Well, that's the idea. You... Go a-hunting. You... Chill there. You... Make the clock pumpkin. They're not a threat anymore. You just wait there for a turn. You just chill. Soon enough, our culture will grow strong enough that it will penetrate through the French territory. And then we'll start being able to really make actual contiguous infrastructure around Tavern Town. Once that happens, the longbowmen will be good. Patrols will only be for crime. I mean, they don't have any crime here, because crime is going down hilariously. Flat, they say. No, we don't like you, England. Well, I mean, we don't like you that much. We we don't dislike England. We just, you know, we, we don't... We're not into them right now. Uh, in the meantime... Yeah, let's get that one. That seems about right. Don't run away. Don't run away. That's, that's, that's not cool. We were having so much fun. Weren't we? That's what we thought. That, that's the feeling that we were getting. Oh, you already have a duber. Okay. Drop that boy. It says it's flat, but we just don't believe it. Like we've we've seen this before. We played this game before. Uh, like literally, we played this game before. We really like this game. Um. So yeah, make that church school go up. Make that clock punk go up. Pay it off, baby. Clock punk time. Oh, yeah. Ooh, the whole game has come down to this. Clock punk's gonna be the big thing. Nobody's gonna be able to outcompete us now. Now we'll be able to fly to the other continent. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. No, 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 nobody cares about you, Justinian. Oh. Okay. Okay, Landonia. Oh, boy, we got it. <laughs> Don't care about that organ hall anymore. There are far more important things. Money-making things at that. All right, all right, all right. Let's be real. We're getting better, apparently, which is nice. We like that. All of y'all just need chill. And, uh... It's difficult 
but we do just have to go back down and start killing more workers and stuff. We don't have much of a choice, actually, in the matter. We need to disrupt all of their infrastructure as much as possible. Lower their comparative power. Darn. Alright, you're just gonna have to chill there. Fisher Town will grow to size 7. That's what we like to hear. Okay. City of Empathy is gonna have to get bolstered a different way. Yeah, but you gotta stay there forever. Uh, a cool thing, yeah, as we were saying, is that no matter who attacks us now, we have 21 patrols, and each one of those patrols has to be defeated before they can take the city. And we're putting more patrols in every turn, so... <coughs> things are gonna be good. Things are gonna actually work out really well, we can feel it. Don't know what happened there, but we don't really care. Probably an assassin got killed. Which is fine. It's completely fine. Because pretty soon here, Tavern Town's going to start becoming self-sufficient. It's not a bad city. We are going to, of course, reject all terms. That's only two. Alright. Landonia is just actually bigger, so it's probably more profitable to bolster them. Let's just chill there. Kill that guy. Murder that person. Move on into the city and get ready to assassinate a treasure later. Uh, okay, we guess. Move that person over. <laughs> it's just getting better, baby! Got a huge garrison. It only gets bigger every day. A pig! Tarot Town, you got you some pigs. Most excellent. Mmm. Things are coming together real good now. We're getting fire brigades. We've got clock punk. This new technology. Clock punk technology. Oh, I'm so excited. This clockwork is becoming a big thing. And nobody else has figured out how, quite how to use it like we when have. The house caught fire, they began digging a well. It ain't happening, Hitler. You want our technology? You can't get our technology. Actually, wait. Let me just look at this real quick. How, how far back? How far back is, uh... Is it relatively recent? Oh, it's, it's very old. You know what? We're only doing this out of strict convenience, Hitler, and because you are so far behind on that train. And we need the money. Cease talking to us. Take what we can get from you and then leave you. Drop you. Uh, okay. It does appear... That usury is probably the best we're going to get here. Hazel Wolf? Crime isn't bad. A spy must have uh, fomented a rebellion. Here! That's fine. Hazel Wolf is no stranger to Rebellion. Like, at all. A French revolt. Clearly. 
clearly Hazel Wolf is falling into bad habits again. Gonna have to deal with that with, uh... Hey, buddy. How's it going? You wanna stay there? Make it easy for us? Kill that treasure. Move over here. Destroy that road. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Let's get that Clockwork Workshop going. We want to see how it will help. So we think at the face of it, we're probably going to send Valence's patrols off to off to Hazel Wolf first to calm them down. Uh... Yeah. Boink. It would be apparent that our forces are needed elsewhere. You get off easy this time, Israel. The French are to be taken care of. Yes, good. Now kill them. <laughs> nice. Alright. How did they get spies and, and stuff into Hazel Wolf, who've been so good for decades? We'll take care of this soon. We'll figure it out. Yes. Yes. No. 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 We could do for better crime. Guess they are quite French, unfortunately. Here. Let's get some much quicker progress. They're happy, too. That should help a bit. Oh, yeah. Put some guys down. Oh. How about you just heal up, buddy? Oh, he got protection real fast. I'm gonna drop back into there. Finish that civil servant school. That'll give us quite a bit of nice money. Mmm. Yeah. We are in an expensive time, to be fair. In quite an expensive time. So that's a big problem. 
But hopefully, the uh, that one good sale of technology from a long obsolete technology for a lot of people will be good. Even if we had to talk to Hitler. We don't Hitler, we don't like Hitler, but sure, whatever, you got us a thing. Tolville, you're already catching on with the times. Get with that clockwork, yeah. Uh Yeah, let's try to save this. Kendon, you're gonna be taken care of for a bit. Hazelwolf, let's get to the bottom of this. What's going on? We think we just needed a token force there. What about you? You're just constantly in danger of falling apart. Alright. You join all these guys. Okay, sure. Yeah, let's keep going. Neanderthals are doing good! We're speeding through. We do not trade technology unless they trade technology back, of course, but we are speeding through. At least, if at all possible. We were almost about to go bankrupt there, and that could not be allowed. Tavern Town. Reject. Oh no, they're kinda angry. Yeah, they must have actually specifically fomented a rebellion. Plop. Uh. That'll work. Let's destroy the pasture while we're at it. If that guy goes down, at least he destroyed some serious stuff while he was at it. Alright, Ken Dunn gets their siege weapons workshop. Troops have discovered a secret entrance into doors. Nice! That's kind of cool. That's not as cool. We don't like that noise. Don't make that noise. That means somebody died in. That's not a great noise either. We'd prefer if you don't make that noise. Oh, come on, man. That's fine. Mark that fool. Come on down here into the bushes. You go to sleep. You guys just hang in there, you know. Uh, you heal with everybody else. You wait till next turn. One moment. Bam. Gotta get that clock punk everywhere. It makes money. Gets people going. It's possibly even provocative. <laughs> Vigilant watch grows to size 17 next turn. Jeez. Vig, you're just working at it. I don't mind that you were taken over. We'll just die. Something. No! You'll never get Clockpunk Canute! Ha! No. No, we're just trying not to trade technology right now.
Get out of here, you. Alright. Move you over here. Drop you off. Move you back. Oh, boy -oh. Well, crime doesn't exist. It just doesn't. Um, they're still very not happy with us. They live in population 500. Come on, man. One moment. Right, nobody can be assigned right now. Literally, if we could just get one turn, we could get a long moment there. That would be great. That would be great. Because that longbowman would guard that city good. We want these to meet up. That would be good. Really, we just want to, like, cut through. Felix Hoffman. Nice. Wait a second. How many of those do we have? We have two great scientists. Which means that we can use one great scientist. Where's that Felix off? Here he is. We can use one of those great scientists. To research anatomy. Nice! We're gonna wait for our golden age until we can get a really Function good proper golden age. To pull and not to push, except yeah. in the case of the genitals and the tongue. That's true. All right. We do not remember having recorded that, but that's our voice, so we must have. Oh. Oh. Yeah! This guy over here! Wrecking shot, son! Oh, we should have taken down that great general, Hella. You just stay right there, we'll get back to you soon enough. Alright. Get that engineering school done. All right, let's go. Power through those technologies. Yes, anatomy. Our people are far advanced of a few other people. We don't know, actually. One moment, let's... Oh boy, yo. Oh. The stuff we got that you don't got is getting more, and the stuff that you got that we don't got is getting less. Let's look at. Nah, nah, nah. Lennon. Nice. Okay, okay. We're starting to get a. A feel for our technological differences here. Nope. You're going down. You're going down, Gustavus. Couldn't let you just sit there and potentially do something big. No, no. Let's just get you to Israel. Let's get, get you to the wide, faraway lands of Israel. Chill there. Sketchtopia, Kuptan, blah blah. Jeez. Vigilant Watch is huge, though, so. Jeez, we do have a lot of cities, don't we? But are there any actual buildings? No? Okay, we'll screw off then. Uh, okay. So let's keep going. This is actually getting pretty good. 
We just got a we got a unique culture that gives us unique economic gains that nobody else will ever be able to get now that we have founded that culture. That is our culture now. You know what that culture makes? That culture makes flying machines, baby! <laughs> yeah! Come on, guys. Oh, yes. Ornithopter Airy. And, and, you know, mortuaries are always good, too, we guess. That's true. Um, Wait for now. Because we're losing so much money, we just have to think about it differently. Okay, there you are. Uh, yeah. You making a road here? We found the trick. Boom. Done. Gotomia will grow to size 6. Good. Good. We are in a fantastic era of population boom. We wonder what our largest cities are uh, populated at. Yeah, that's Tavern Town again. Up to seven, of course. And... Oh, man. Are you sure you want to do this? Like, because, you know, we can, we can literally just do this, right? Die. Die. Didn't even mean to do that. They're probably gonna... No, they probably aren't gonna die next turn. Never mind. <laughs> Drop them off. Get going. Chill. We're still just destroying everything they do. So it's good for our culture, because we keep winning more than we keep losing. And we have plenty of people to spare. We have the second largest population in the world, eventually soon to be the first largest population in the world. We, we got a lot of ones here, a lot of first places here. So, we I mean, we can't, we have a whole continent all to ourselves. We can fight them. Crop yield, highest. Pretty strong. Largest area. Largest population? Wow! Our population boom really means something now. Largest life expectancy. Our approval rating, it'll go up soon. It's because we make so much food, probably, that uh, we have such a gigantic population boom going on. on back. Oh boy, yo! We got us a llama worker. Oh, that's good. Now we have a worker in the area. So as soon as the... As soon as the culture expands even just a tiny little bit, we will have it. Bring it on home. Oh, jeez. Well, Israel is quite pathetic now. We'll see how that goes. We're not going to give up the fight against France. Maybe Polynesia, Celtia, China, sure, whatever. Not France. France is right here. Fran We're ready to take down France. Not Celtia, actually, because Celtia has been a butthole the entire time. Nope, sorry, Lenin. 
Nope, we need those. Ha ha. There really is just so many 27 patrols trying to deal with the the problems. All right, come on. Oh. We're almost feeling like we should, we don't know, move out or something. But then we'd leave all of our biggest guys outside and not protecting. Hmm. Nope. Lame. Gladiator school it is. Wait. Uh, make that keep tower. Drop a dude off. Come on back to base. You who were waiting, jump on. You heal with everybody else. This guy, annihilate. Please, if you don't mind. This guy's like a total baller. A stone cold hyper beast that we just really need to unlock. Uh, we really un need to unlock attack more than once a turn with. Yeah. Oh. Okay. No. Screw you then. What? Killed your great general, fool. What now? Gonna heal up on your own land. Can we... We shouldn't, but we're gonna. Heal up, one turn. 30 patrols, which in strict hypothesis means, like... Uh... Six cultural provocations, a lot of cultural revolt protection, and it's still not doing anything. Can't give money. But crime is at an all time low. Uh. Once we get Tavern Town settled, it'll be a utopia. Honest. Uh, oh, 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 looks like we did have a small expansion of uh, culture as well. We got the second uh, bloop here. It's getting closer. Soon, Tavern Town, soon. Don't worry a bit. Reject the terms. Don't worry, these patrols are the best. They will get the job done. Man, this guy just really needs to learn how to kill more than one person a turn. Nope, not gonna happen. Oh, wait. <laughs> Take it, Taurus. Alright. Got like a hundred turns or whatever that we can keep up this law, so it's all good. We don't like... We don't like how rough it is to be doing this. Oh, I got that officium going. 
Yeah, just maintain that. You go to sleep there. We'll wait for a turn. Uh... Okay. Almost there, buddy. Okay. Good, good. Keep healing. Wait a turn. Move back to here. Isotopia grows to size 10. Nice. Proper cities all around the entire empire right now. It's really, really good. Just smashing through. Looks like India's working on chivalry. Alright, let's go to that. Keep marching. And... Okay, the old system is viable again. Let's go. Drop. Return. Uh, get that officium done. Okay, now we're just gonna start wrecking shop. Go ahead. Anybody else want to try that again? No, it's cool. These guys are like 20 plus stacks. Pretty sure they could take your first assault at least for a little bit. Yeah, usury, woo! In the 20th century, we're just learning how to make loans. Or something. In control will Good. The Do nation. it. Uh. Does that not make a revolution? Yeah, that's our question. Does that... Zero turns! Uh, okay, so we're at Public Works right now. Um... It's not actually bad. Let's do it. Alright, next. Oh, well, everybody knows how important the martial arts are to us, but also we need mountaineering. Martial arts. We're at war right now. Uh, alright. Whoops. We really hope that we didn't just cut off the, uh... Recording, because that sometimes happens, but if we did, that's okay. Uh, because this is actually about the right time for us to go. We hope you liked what you saw. If you did, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree link in the description. Hit up all the other places that we do stuff. Go on down to our Patreon if you're an especially attractive and well-educated watcher. And pledge even just $1 a month to join the Money Money ranks of Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time. And Tollpants are our number one watcher of all time. And get your name in the game, because remember, all these cities are named after patrons. Thanks a bunch, everybody, for coming and staying as long as you did. Stay safe, stay inside, stay healthy, and of course, remember to help each other. Bye!